Hi everyone, RT Custer from the Custer and Wolf show, Custer and Wolf building a watch company, Vortec watch company, coming back for another solo episode today. So today we're talking about how we used email marketing to grow our brand, or how you can use email marketing to grow your brand. I am super passionate about email marketing. If you haven't if, you, if you're not on our email list, head to vorticwatches.com and sign up so you can see what I'm talking about. But email marketing is one of the biggest ways, if not the biggest way, that we've grown Vortec Watch Company over the last couple of years. And I'm a big fan of that marketing style because I just know it works. But I wanna tell you why we're talking about this first. So a few years ago, Tyler, my business partner, came to me I was doing what our director of operations, Kyle, does now, which is talking to every single customer, emailing each customer, you know, packaging the watches. We were, there was like a, just two or three of us at that point, and so I was hands-on. And he said, what if you, instead of talking to each customer individually, he said, RT, if you're running marketing, what if every time you opened your mouth, you spoke to 10,000 customers? And I was like, first of all, what'd you do with my business partner, Tyler? And who's this marketing guru that's just speaking to me right now? And second of all, holy shit, like you're onto something. This, this is, that's, that's what it's all about. How do we reach more people? Also around that same time, I joined a mastermind called Fast Foundations and Nick Harder, now a good friend of mine, he told me if you're, he told all of us in this mastermind, he said, if you are not using email marketing and you do not have an email journey set up for your business, you've already lost. And I was like, Nick, how'd you know I love to win? Like, why did you say this to me? Now I have to go build an email journey. So that's why we're talking about it. That's how I got into it a few years ago. And over the last few years, the vorticwatches.com email list has grown from roughly 3,000 people uh, three years ago, which was mostly just customers and followers that signed up through Shopify, to now over 40,000 people that get a weekly email. And I know, and I've looked at the data and I've seen this, I can attribute over a million dollars in sales from the last few years through vorticwatches.com directly to this email journey and the email sends that we do every week. So the biggest thing we've learned about email marketing is that the key, and I think this is the key to all marketing, is consistency. Another key, another key to success for us is automation. So consistency and automation, what that, what that means for email marketing, one is we send a weekly email newsletter and we've, I've hit send on an email every Tuesday for three straight years. That's consistent, we know it works. We also have an email journey that's over 20 emails long. And if you don't know what I'm talking about, it's basically when you sign up for our email list, you, you get an automated email every five to seven days for hundreds of days. It's, it's you know, oh, I think it's 22 emails long now. And that all happens automatically. And those emails tell you about Vortec Watches, tell you about what we do, and educate you on the brand to hopefully let you uh, buy a watch. So that's what we're talking about today. That's why, and the, the biggest reason why now, and why we're kind of, you know, showing you, I'm gonna show you all the data here on my screen and show you all everything that we do, is we're switching from Campaign Monitor, which is one email service provider, to Klaviyo, which is a new one. Klaviyo just got a $100 million investment from Shopify. Shopify is where we have our website hosted. And so obviously Shopify is a huge fan of Klaviyo. And so we are going to switch to Klaviyo and kind of ride that wave with those two big tech companies. And all of this awesome data that we've gained over the last few years will go away. And I think one of the major things that uh, entrepreneurs don't do often enough is celebrate their successes. Um, Sam Walton told us that in his 10 rules. Celebrate your successes, look backwards and see where you came from and realize how far you've come. And I just wanna celebrate that this some of this data um, with you and our followers and thank you, our, our customers, for supporting us over the years and opening and reading these emails. So let's dive in here on my screen. On our website, we have, as you scroll down, you can see this little sign up button on the right. That This is what happens. 
when you type your name and your email into that sign up block, you subscribe to our email newsletter. You can also subscribe in the footer down here and there's pop-ups throughout the site. It's on every single page. There's a, a request to sign up for our email newsletter. And what happens when you do that is this automation and this is called an email journey. So when a new subscriber joins the general email list, one day later, some people they do this, you know, one hour later, one minute later. For us, we, we make it really slow because our products are expensive and so we want people to slowly, you know, we wanna welcome you to our brand slowly. And so um, one day later you get this email, which is our story. And so if I look at the, the data from this email, this email has been sent to 20,000 people and 32% of them have opened that. I'm gonna say that I get 32% open rate on this entry email, the first email. If you know email marketing, then your jaw just hit the floor because that is three times industry average. Click rates are usually one or 2%, so that's a pretty good click rate on the first email. And what this email is, is literally just our story. It says, and, and all of this is written in first person. It's me personally writing this email to you, but this is an automated email. It happens automatically. So it says, I'm RT, this is Tyler. We built Vortic Watch Company for you. And here's what we do. And as you scroll down, it just tells a story. Here's a picture of us from filming our Kickstarter campaign in, in our garage, you know, in 2014. Um, a little behind the scenes stuff and it sets the stage and it tells you you're going to get an email every every week or so that's going to tell you about our company and so back to this journey here's what this looks like as i scroll down every 10 days and i'm i'm switching this in our new automation i think i'm going to make it every five days and educate people a little quickly a little more quickly plus i'm probably going to add more emails but every 10 days we send another email and i'm going to move this over here so as you can see, people drop off. So this second email has been sent to only 18,700 people, but it still has a good open rate. And as I scroll down, every email gets sent every 10 days. And then after the first five emails are sent, there's a piece of logic in here. And it says, if you have not opened any of those first five emails, then we unsubscribe you from this list because we don't want to spam you if you're not opening these emails and you're not enjoying the ride, the journey, right? And so only the people that have opened those emails continue on. And check this out, when I click on this next email, this is the sixth email that gets sent. This has only gone to 7,500 people, but look at that open rate, 48%. So now I'm only talking to the people that, that care, right? So this is the point of an email journey. Each one of these emails has a different purpose. This sixth one says, here's what the customers are saying. So it's all about testimonials. The seventh one is all about history. It's the history of the great American watch companies. So 70 days into this journey, you'll learn about the history of the great American watch companies, et cetera, et cetera. You can see also in this email software, how many people are waiting between this email and the next one, which is when there's 600 people that are about to get this one. And then every five emails, I do that same thing. Has anyone opened one of the last five? And if they haven't, we unsubscribe them. And so now as you get down here, this email has only been sent to 3,600 people, but has a 65% open rate. It's massive, the, the um, readership that we get from this and the people that actually respond to these emails. These are all automated. This all happens without us clicking or touching anything. And people will, sub will not only subscribe to this, but they will answer these emails with a question. Because I encourage, in, inside each one of these emails, I say, hey, if you have any questions, like here at the bottom, just respond to this email and, and let's talk, you know? And those questions go right to us. And so it welcomes people into the company and it educates people on what we do. And that's why they call it an email journey. So that's part of it. The other part of email marketing that we use is a weekly campaign. So I can't stress this enough. I still do this myself. I think entrepreneurs should do all of their own email marketing and set all this up and write it in their own words for as long as they can. 
you can absolutely hire an agency for all this stuff. An ad agency, a marketing agency can do this. And we have a whole team that helps us put this together. You know, I didn't take the photos that are in these emails. Um, I didn't write a lot of these words, but I put it all together. And I personally hit send every Tuesday and have for three years. And because this is my way, like Tyler said in the beginning, to speak to every single customer. And so what each one of these emails looks like, if I hit send on every Tuesday, we have thousands of people, you know, it's about a 30% open rate again, thousands of people that open each one of these emails every Tuesday. Obviously we get some unsubscribes, people think it's spam, they forget they signed up, that's all very normal, but we get these clicks. So these are all your clicks that people are coming from your email back to your website or over to YouTube. So here's what this weekly email journey looks like. And here's a couple pro tips um, that, that we've learned over the years. So we say your weekly roundup of one of a kind watches is below, but first, and then this, and I deliver the executive summary of what I want you to learn right in the beginning of this email. And I think that that's massively important to have that like executive summary at the top of these weekly emails is huge because it sets the stage as why should I keep reading? Why should I keep scrolling? And I say, we deliver this weekly email with your weekly roundup because we do one of a kind watches. So every week we have, we have now we have six, we're gonna go to seven pretty soon, but we make one new one of a kind watch every day. So we call it the weekly roundup and we say, here's the last few watches that we made. That's at the bottom of the email. At the top of the email, I say, here's what's happening this week. Here's a YouTube video we just made. Here's um, a, a trade show we're about to go to. Check it out. And that keeps people engaged. And the people that want to just see the watches, they can just scroll down. And the people that want to keep up with us, they can see everything they need to know right at the top of this email. So back to this email, we have that all at the top here. Here's what we're working on. Um, in this email, we said, say hello to season two. That's what this YouTube show is all about. Um, so we launched season two here in the studio. Um, that's what the top of this email was about. We have calls to action here. Click to watch on YouTube. You can see hundreds of people clicked on that link. Subscribe on YouTube. And then as you scroll down, here's the weekly roundup. So each watch gets its own feature in this email. And you can read about each watch. Now, one thing that I just kind of remembered as we, we talk about email is one of the other things we've learned is every time we hit send on one of these emails that we send every Tuesday, somebody on the team will take all of this content, copy, edit it slightly and paste it onto a blog on our website. So now every single word that's in this email becomes great SEO content on our website. And you'll see that as the blog on our site. So just another thing that, that I think helps um, in a massive way. So that's the logic behind email marketing. That's why we do it. Vastly important. And if you are interested in this, if you want to learn more about it, obviously subscribe here on YouTube. We're going to do lots more videos about this and about how we've built Vortic. Um, we call it building a watch company because we're building multiple watch companies, not just Vortic but you have to learn from where you came from in order to know where you're going. And so we're gonna do a lot of this, like here's what's worked type of videos about Vortic as we go. And you can also email me anytime. I'm, it's really simple, it's rt at vorticwatches.com. Um, just hit me up, I, I, I love email marketing, I love talking about this stuff. So if there's any questions that you have, um, if you're watching this and you're just like, I, I want to make sure I'm on the email list. I can make sure that you, you have your right email on that list um, and I can share all that. But uh, here I am on the Custer and Wolf YouTube channel. If you haven't been here, it's just Custer and Wolf on YouTube. We put out an episode every week here. The last solo episode I did was about the definition of American made. So check that one out. Every other week, it's myself and Tyler sitting here in the studio talking about, you know, what we're working on for Vortic. And you can subscribe right up here on that little subscribe button and check us out. And then again, best way to keep in touch with us, head back to our website here, vorticwatches.com. Click on this little slider on the side, Let's get on this email list. You will get one of those emails every Tuesday. You'll be able to watch these YouTube videos and you'll be able to follow along. Thank you. And I appreciate you watching and learning about email marketing. That's how we've built the email marketing system for Vortic Watch Company.